Hey there. I'm so excited to have you here. My name is Sarah Kaminsky. I am a 30 something mom. I'm a certified holistic health and lifestyle coach, and I have 10 plus years serving women in the field of health and wellness. I'm so excited to dive into some of the solutions today that have completely transformed my life and continue to transform the lives of so many other women just like you. I know your time is super valuable, so let's just dive right in. All right, we should be in presentation mode, so let's dive in. You're probably wondering if you're in the right place. Well, if you love food, like good, whole, real food, and you just wanna be able to enjoy food and the events that come with food, and just feel fully in tune with your body, and stop worrying about it so much. You're in the right place if you almost wonder where the old you went, if you feel exhausted, like you have to peel yourself out of bed every single morning, and you feel like you're in a constant state of irritable brain fog. You might find yourself constantly reflecting on how you looked and felt five, 10, 15 years ago. You might even be experiencing embarrassing digestive issues like constipation or urgency, or maybe even embarrassing skin issues like eczema, discoloration, mouth sores, cystic acne, or warts. This picture on the far right, that's my back just a few years ago. You might even be experiencing irregular cycles or fertility struggles. I struggled with amenorrhea, irregular cycles, and recurrent miscarriages. This is painful and real. And you're probably so ready to feel like yourself again so you can feel joy and be present in your life. You might be avoiding social functions, avoiding the camera, or spending endless hours beating yourself up for just not following through. When you're not constantly feeling like crap, when you're freed of all the negative things that you tell yourself, you suddenly have so much more free time and mental energy to actually live your life and enjoy the important people in it. So after today, you are going to clearly understand why diets might be doing you more harm than good. You are going to know how to develop a fail-proof nutrition plan that isn't cookie cutter, it's totally unique to you, and you're gonna see the pattern of thinking that is holding you back from experiencing the next great thing in your life. We're gonna talk about how to find trustworthy diet, nutrition, and lifestyle information that you can actually apply to your life beginning today. I'm also going to share answers to questions that every woman needs to hear around nutrition, stress, and mindset, plus exhausting mistakes to avoid. Today, I'm revealing four secrets to shift your mindset around food and nutrition, see the positive intention in your symptoms, your pain, your excess weight, and eliminate painful self-judgment so that you can feel confident, be present, and be able to enjoy your life. I'll also show you how I help my clients not only heal their relationship with food and their bodies, but have massive breakthroughs on the road to healing, feeling amazing in their bodies, and improving their overall quality of life. I'm also sharing with you how I went from chronically dieting, struggling with missing and irregular cycles, constipation, crazy moods, mouth sores, loss of skin pigmentation, brittle hair, brittle nails, and being in a constant state of brain fog to feeling high energy, confident, motivated, comfortable in my skin, and completely tuned into what my body needs with a focus solely on food, lifestyle, and mindset. I'll be sharing every single detail. So you'll want to stay to the end to clearly understand how I help my clients heal their relationship with food and their bodies without quick fixes, without pills, starvation diets, negative self-talk, or bullshit. This is possible for you. My clients not only heal their relationship with food, but they also balance their hormones. They heal chronic skin issues and irritable bowels. They eliminate brain fog. They regulate their monthly cycles. They have healthy pregnancies. They lower their blood pressure, their cholesterol, and some have even reversed type 2 diabetes. And here's the thing. You can do this too. So let me guess. 
you've spent years on and off diets, cleanses, you probably feel exhausted and overwhelmed, you're tired of depriving yourself, you feel confused by all the diet and nutrition advice out there and feel like nothing ever sticks. You probably don't have the energy to get out of bed in the morning and you might feel like the walking dead. Have you ever considered that it's not necessarily the number of hours that you're getting in every night, but an imbalance that is contributing to your fatigue? It's possible that you're wasting valuable time every single day sifting through all the diet, nutrition, and holistic healing advice out there, and perhaps you've seen doctor after doctor after doctor and feel like you've been chasing your tail with no answers, or maybe you're just this close to settling, to giving up, telling yourself that this is just what it's like to get older, to live in pain and feel tired and have excess weight. But let's be honest, if you had really given up, you wouldn't be here engaging in this workshop today. You know deep down that something needs to change. And if you're one of those people that is experiencing embarrassing skin or digestive issues, listen, the skin is our biggest organ. This, a skin issue is like the body screaming for help from the inside out. I struggled with a condition called tinea versicolor, where your skin loses pigmentation. I also struggled with chronic mouth sores and cystic pimples that were so embarrassing that I didn't want to leave the house. And the constipation issue, it was real and it was really painful. You might even struggle with amenorrhea or irregular cycles that not only cause stress but can be the reason why you have low libido, fatigue, and can of course be the painful root cause of infertility or recurrent miscarriages. The real problem it's just that you're missing a few key shifts that can take you from being held hostage to your symptoms, feeling completely trapped, to feeling high energy, confident, motivated, comfortable in your skin, and completely tuned in to what your body needs. And after you apply these four shifts, you will be able to release painful self-judgment, heal your relationship with food, and actually be happy and stress-free when it comes to food and nutrition. After you apply these four shifts, you will feel the effect that certain foods have on your body. Yes, so that means understanding that certain foods are a good fit for your unique body. And once you're tapped into your intuition and operating from this place, you're able to consistently, for the rest of your life, make food choices that really serve you. After you apply these shifts, you're going to understand why your symptoms are actually a good thing. Yes, you heard that right. Your symptoms, your pain, your excess weight, they're actually a good thing. And you'll have the energy and the stamina to be a true, happy, active participant in your life. Because let's be honest, if you're feeling embarrassed, too tired, too low, or in too much pain, you are not living to your fullest potential. Feeling this way is no way to live. Trust me, I've been here. So before we dive in today, I wanted to share a little bit of a personal story with you. Uh, this is a picture of me and my family, but we weren't always this beaming and happy, right? Um, back in my 20s, I remember clearly laying in bed at night and feeling low and coming up with these grand plans about how I was going to get skinny. I tried everything. I did diet pills. I tried low carb. That was horrible. I did grapefruit, cabbage soup. I counted points and calories and portions. I would over-exercise. I would save up and binge. I would drink my calories. It was like this constant struggle between getting back on track or just being like, well, screw it, and drinking wine and eating Snackwell's cookies for dinner, even though I had just restocked my fridge with fresh produce. I was always looking for the next big thing that was going to give me the body that I really wanted, but I was really, really stuck in this like stop again and stop again train. And I wonder why I couldn't get out of bed in the morning, why I struggled with constipation, and why I couldn't just get skinny. In my early 30s, about a year and a half after my first child was born, I was the thinnest I had ever been. And this was also the real beginning of what I now recognize was a completely warped body image. I mean, don't get me wrong. I loved my body here, but I did not fully enjoy my life. I was too busy obsessing about food. I did these three-day starvation cleanses regularly to sort of like reboot or get back on track. I was super judgmental every time I ate too many carbs too much fat, or even if we just like went to get an ice cream cone with our family. All of these years of chronically dieting, food stress, and having a super poor relationship 
with food in my body ultimately triggered a string of really ugly symptoms, including missing any regular cycles, constipation, totally crazy moods, chronic mouth sores, dry skin, brittle hair and nails, and a constant state of brain fog. I began to see doctor after doctor and I couldn't get any answers. I could not take it anymore. Something needed to change. And it did. If we fast forward three and a half years, I finally in this place in my adult life where I have a healthy relationship with food, a healthy relationship with my body, and I've completely reclaimed my life. No more diets, no more starvation cleanses, no more judgment or irregular cycles, no more crazy moods or constipation, no more brain fog. The list goes on. I have finally discovered a way to eat and be in a way that serves my body, serves my mind, and is sustainable for the rest of my life. I'm so excited to share this with you. So here's the shocking truth. 95% of Americans are out there searching for the solution for the body and the health that they desire. I was in this 95% for a really long time. And not only was my relationship with food unhealthy, but my health was slowly declining as well. If this cookie cutter approach worked, 95% of us wouldn't be out there looking for the next big thing to shed pounds or heal our bodies. This approach is failing us big time. So what I finally did was studied the 5%. These are the 5% of people who are not only achieving their health goals, but they are maintaining them for life. And I applied what I learned. I not only healed my body, but I healed my relationship with food by completely just transforming my mindset, transforming my lifestyle, and identifying the right foods for my body. I have helped countless of other women do this without quick fixes, without pills or starvation cleanses, without negative self-talk or any crazy bullshit. And 100% of these women have experienced major breakthroughs that have completely changed their lives. Many have not only healed the relationship with food, but they've balanced their hormones. They've healed chronic skin issues and irritable bowels. They have cleared the fog in their brains and They've regulated their monthly cycles. Those that wanted it have had healthy pregnancies, lowered blood pressure, cholesterol, and even reversed type 2 diabetes. And they did it using these four simple steps. So here's the thing. There are as many diets as there are people on the planet. And once you are tuned in and able to identify the right foods unique to your body, incredible things begin to happen. Your metabolic fire ignites. Your hormones, they naturally balance. Pain disappears. Blood pressure, blood sugar, they normalize. And when taken care of, your body has the ability to put energy into what it does best. And that's giving you energy to do the things that you love and be a present active participant in your life with the people that you love. Another reason that the diet approach doesn't work is that it's based off of deprivation. Deprivation, it's cool for a short period of time, right? It works, but it's not sustainable for the long term. Eventually, we look and feel like this dog. And more often than not, we not only eat one cupcake, we eat two, three, four, maybe even five to make up for lost time. Can you relate? So what we really want is to get to this place where we feel in control, where we feel confident that we know exactly what our body wants and needs in order to most effectively metabolize, burn fat, expend energy, and function every day without pain, without health problems, without excess weight or disease. So let's dive into the four solutions. The first layer here is to release judgment. If you ever felt like you're in the spin cycle of a washing machine, judgment is oftentimes just like that, getting caught in the spin cycle. It's this never ending cycle, it looks sort of like this. Let's just say you wake up in the morning, you peel yourself out of bed finally after hitting the snooze button four times and you think to yourself, Ugh, I did it again, right? So this thought is going to ignite an emotion or trigger an emotion associated with failure. And that failure is going to trigger your next action, which might be to grab a donut from the staff lounge or maybe just like eat your kids' leftover breakfast off of their plate. Now, this action is going to create a result, right? So you're going to probably feel tired and irritable 
from not putting high quality nutrients in your body. And you're going to think to yourself, God, I did it again. That thought is going to trigger emotions associated with failure, which is going to trigger another action. So maybe you eat alone at your desk or you eat your kids leftover mac and cheese at lunch, right? You continue to feel tired and irritable. You think to yourself, God, I did it again. You continue to feel emotions associated with failure, which is going to continue to influence your action, which might be to sit down in the afternoon and scroll social media while your child is napping or instead of doing productive things at home or at work in the afternoon, you're going to continue to feel tired and irritable. Can you relate to this cycle? So what we don't often realize is that humans, we as humans are emotionally driven beings. So that means that what is happening right here, it drives how we feel, which determines the action we take. And it ultimately gives us the results that we get, whether or not we want it. So what we can do is take that same example and we can shift it to a way that releases judgment and keeps us in action. So let's just take the same example. We wake up after four snoozes, we're really kind of peeling ourselves out of bed. And instead of beating ourselves up about it, we say, well, that wasn't the way I wanted to start the day, but I'm choosing to move forward, okay? So this thought is going to trigger emotions that are associated with empowerment. Maybe like, I'm kicking life's ass today, right? And this empowering emotion is going to trigger our actions. So you're going to pack the snack that you brought to work and you're gonna have that mid-morning. Or perhaps you're going to have a nice balanced snack mid-morning at home. You're gonna feel high energy and productive. You'll move forward. You're going to continue to feel like you're kicking life's ass. You're feeling empowered. So that's gonna influence your action. You're gonna work on a project deadline or do something productive in the afternoon. You'll continue to feel high energy and productive. You'll continue to move forward feel like you're kicking life's ass. And then in the afternoon, you'll prepare yourself a nice, beautiful cup of hot tea to sort of ease your way into the evening and continue to feel high energy and productive. Pretty powerful shift, right? So I want to introduce you to Shannon. She came to me feeling totally pressed up against a wall. She was sick of beating herself up about what she did or didn't eat. She, for years, had been going through phases of living on meal replacement shakes, not enjoying social events, and was beginning to realize that the relationship that she had with her body was negatively impacting her preteen daughter. She finally feels, after our work together, that she has tools for a lifetime, and most importantly, to model for her daughter as she enters her teen years. How empowering is that? The next solution here is to identify high energy foods for your unique body. Here's the thing. Your body is telling you at all times what it needs. It's just that sometimes we're tuned out or we've forgotten how to listen. You know that saying, listen to your gut? I mean, yeah, we know how to do that when it comes to making decisions for our kids, for our home, for our job. But for some reason, we don't trust what comes up for our needs. This is about adopting a slowdown movement, which allows space to really tune in to what your body is telling you. And when we're operating from this place, we're able to effectively honor hunger and fullness, identify high energy foods for your body. This not only helps your metabolic fire stay lit, but it helps to ward off disease, balance hormones, eliminate pain, and keep your body in a place of homeostasis. You know, that place where all of your body functions are just operating at max capacity, where all of your cells are happy and bursting with energy. Here's the thing, guys, not all foods deemed as healthy are healthy for every one body. And what's worse is we often stress about what to eat and what not to eat. And the truth is that the body cannot heal or release weight in a stressed state. The good news is it's easy to simplify this process. And I promise it does not have to taste bland or boring. I'm so excited to introduce you to Lacey. She holds such a special place in my heart. She came to me with hope that she could break through her plateau, that number on the scale that she just could not seem to get past after her second child. After just one week of listening to her body, she plowed through the plateau, hitting the pre-pregnancy weight from before her first child. 
My favorite part about her story is how this way of eating positively impacted her cholesterol. Her doctor was so impressed by her numbers that she took her off of her cholesterol meds completely. It has been nearly four years and she has never gone back. The third solution and such an important layer is to put yourself back on your to-do list. Hey, listen, we live in a very busy world. We juggle a career, a family, relationships, a household, and we're constantly expected to be available, whether it's over email or text message, social. So no wonder we're feeling overwhelmed and like we have no time. The truth is there is no way to slow the world down, but what we can control is to identify and begin to honor what's most important in our little world. This shifts us out of overwhelm and into action. And this oftentimes involves taking off your superwoman cape, being like okay with saying no, letting go of some other things to make time for things like this. And I know what you're thinking right now. You're calling me crazy. Like, right, Sarah, let me just find some extra time in my day to sit down and read a book or whatever it is that makes me happy. Listen, trust me, every tiny shift makes a huge impact on your most valuable and irreplaceable asset, your time. This is Virginia. She came to me as a caretaker to her young grandson and she was feeling suffocated. She felt like her time was no longer hers, that she no longer had healthy boundaries. It was affecting her health, her sleep, her moods, her patience. So together we took a step back and we identified what was in her control and what wasn't. This put her back in the driver's seat. She adopted a morning ritual that set the tone for each day. And in just six weeks, she gained confidence to open up to her daughter about how she was feeling in her caretaking role. And together they were able to make alternate arrangements for her grandson two days each week, which opened the space that she really wanted and desired. The final solution here is to shift your focus. Hey, it's really easy to get stuck in the victim mentality when life is hard. This idea of like everyone gets what they want and woe is me. Life happens to me, not for me. And this can be really hard because some of these belief systems are buried so deep that they are ingrained as part of our being. But here's the thing. No one on the planet is in control of these thoughts and beliefs but you. You have the ability to shift your focus. Change what you believe. Change what you ultimately create for your health and for your life. And hey, that big fat mess of symptoms or excess weight that you're experiencing, have you considered that there are actually positive messengers for a new solution? Kind of like, hey, our insides are a little bit out of whack. Can you help us please? The moment I began to see my imbalances as positive messengers, so much began to open up for me. And it will for you too. So excited to introduce you to Donna. She was literally on the brink of despair when we met. Working a highly stressful, taxing job with long hours. She was struggling with chronic joint pain. Trigger finger, that's where your finger literally just locks in place. And she was also struggling with irritable bowels. She was really caught up in how she looked and felt 15 years prior, and it was holding her back big time. I met her right where she was. She was able to identify herself as someone worth taking care of, and we began to reframe some of the beliefs that were holding her back by consistently eating the right foods, believing truly that this was possible for her. Everything began to come together. Her energy had increased. Her urgency resolved. Her joint pain dissipated. And guess what? That trigger finger, this is unbelievable. It unlocked. She was back in control, celebrating the symptoms that led to her healing and staying focused on where she was going, not stuck on where she once was. So if you're tired of feeling like you've lost yourself, if you're tired of overanalyzing, procrastinating, putting pressure on yourself, if you're sick of feeling like crap, going all in or doing nothing, or in your heart of hearts you know that your body is out of balance, we should connect. I want to answer these questions and so many more. It is okay to be supported. Listen, you are enough. Where you are right now, not where you were in your 20s, not where you're going to be when you have this all figured out, not where your coworker is, your sister, that girl you keep seeing on your Instagram feed, you. This is about honoring and celebrating where you are right now, creating a vision for where you want to be. 
and layering in the simple shifts necessary to get from where you are to where you want to be and begin to fill that gap. So here's the deal, right? You have options. You can stay right where you are. I, perhaps you could continue to just navigate this and figure it all out on your own, or you can get support from someone who has done this and begin to implement the four simple shifts and strategies that we talked about today, heal your relationship with food, heal your body, prevent long-term health issues, love and respect your body, feel comfortable in your skin, and have the energy to be present and feel joy with the important people in your life. Listen, you don't need more information. You don't need another webinar. You don't need another Google search. If you're tired of chasing your own tail, if you're tired of feeling defeated, you don't need more information. What you do need is the loving support to guide you in figuring out a plan that is going to work for you, as well as the accountability to actually stick to it. What do you want for your life? What are you currently doing to get there? If you want to feel happy and proud, energetic, confident, in control, if you want to bring yourself up like you bring up others and truly live your life without any limitations, what are you doing right now to get yourself there? I want to share a very special opportunity to speak with me personally about how you can apply the four shifts that we've talked about today in your life and your health situation today. I've opened up a handful of slots in my calendar over the next week to speak with me. On the call, we will work together to create your custom action plan. So whether it's to simplify the diet and nutrition advice out there, reconnect with your partner, feel confident enough to get out there and make a career change, take the opportunity to figure out what the heck it is that you really need in this season of your life, all while healing your body so that you no longer need to live with pain, rely on medications, or excess weight, this is an incredible opportunity for you to jump back in the driver's seat. You can go right to sarahkaminsky.com backslash discovery session to book your call, or just click the button here on the page. Listen, you can heal your relationship with food. You can be present and honor your body, feel confident in your skin. You absolutely can identify the unique foods that give you energy to feel passion and connection reignited back in your relationship or the confidence to get out there and date again. You may want to figure out what it is that you truly desire and what you need as you enter a new chapter in your life or to heal your body from imbalance or disease, but you don't want to just sit back and watch it. You want to experience it and you know that deep down you need the energy and the health to do it. So here's how it works. It's simple. Just click the button below, choose your time zone, choose your time slot, complete the short client health history form, and I'll call you at your scheduled time. That's it. You can reserve your spot now by going to sarahkaminsky.com backslash discovery session, or just click the button here on the page. This is for you if you're ready to take action, if you're ready to step into your power and make changes, if you value support, guidance, accountability, if you feel like you're not really sure where to start, you might even feel overwhelmed by starting, but you feel ready to begin to implement the four simple shifts that we've discussed today, this is for you. If you are not truly ready to take action, a 60-minute call with information, it's going to be meaningless. I look for women who are eager to be present and engaged in their lives with the people that they love. If this is you, book your call now. Some of the common things that hold women back, and I know this because I experienced it myself, it's self-doubt. Like, how can this even be possible for me? Well, that's because 95% of the things that you've tried have failed. I get it. I've been there. What if I told you that by consistently applying the four shifts that we've covered in this workshop, by developing your action plan on the one-hour call, that this is possible for you? During the call, I will share with you proven strategies, and it's completely free. If you're serious about transforming your health, I will personally teach you how to skyrocket your results. And these are not short-term, quick fixes. These are strategies that you will easily apply to the rest of your life. I remember being so desperate for an answer. I was so sick of not fully understanding the impact that certain foods were having on my body. I was tired of feeling like crap. I was tired of obsessing about food and feeling totally out of tune with my body. I felt like I was going to be stuck in this terrible cycle forever. 
I was growing apart from my husband. I was not a fully present mother. And I was honestly totally fearful about what might happen to my long-term health if I stayed on the trajectory I was on. Don't let being busy stop you. Your life experience is way too valuable to continue to live like this. You can start experiencing massive transformation in body and mind today, and it all starts with this call. These do fill fast, so you can head right over to my website at sarahkaminsky.com backslash discovery session to book your call. You might be wondering why I'm doing this. Well, this has made a huge impact on my life, and I'm called to help other women find the same freedom and vitality. Plus, I know how important it is not only to have a clear plan, but the support and accountability from a real human being along the way. If we do decide to work together, you get the exact step-by-step -step system with exclusive membership site, one-on-one, -on -one, group coaching, and my personalized support. This experience is exactly what I have applied to my own life and that I give to all of my clients. It's comprehensive and it works. We layer everything in week to week to keep you out of overwhelm and into action. You receive coaching from me personally. Yes, a real human being. I guide you step by step so you are never, ever alone. You'll want to book now. These time slots are limited and they will fill fast, especially as we approach the new year. If you have any final questions, go ahead and type them in the chat and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you so much for taking the time to tune in and engage today. I cannot wait to connect.